Hello, and welcome to Cindy's Corner. Today, boys and girls, it's Valentine's Day, and we're going to make up something special for your loved one. So, if you'll get your pencil and paper, and you can follow along, if you want to watch this first so that you can soak it all in, we're going to make an easy rose for so that you can make it as a card. And... Just follow along. It's going to be real simple. And you can always write at Happy Valentine's Day on it. You can write, I love you. And we're just going to give somebody a rose today. Would you like that? Let's give them a rose. And while you're getting your paper and pencil, if you haven't subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Okay, here we go. Now, we're going to start out in the middle, and you might want to turn your paper. This is called horizontal, uh, vertical, up and down, because we're going to make a rose. We're going to make a rose. So, I hope you can see that, and um, I'm using my black marker. I want you to use a pencil first, because that way, if you have to erase, you can erase I'm on a dry erase board, so I'm going to use my dry erase marker so that you can see it. And then if I mess up, just bear with me, okay? Because I'll have to use a little eraser, and and sometimes it just marks off, okay? You know how a dry erase board does. So you're going to start here, and you're going to make a smiley face. Just make a big smiley face there. Can you see that? Let me make it a little bigger so that you can see. Okay, we're going to start with our smiley face, and then from that smiley face, we're going to come over here, and we're going to make kind of like a rainbow. Come around and touch, and then we're going to come from this side, and we're going to make half of a rainbow, but we're going to stop at that line. And then we're going to finish it with like a triangle in the middle. It's kind of more like a tulip, doesn't it? Okay. All right. Then we're going to make two straight lines down. Close together because that's our stem. That is a stem. This is our bud. This is our stem. And from our stem here, we're going to kind of make... We're going to make like a smiley face come out. And then we're going to make kind of a rainbow come in and make a leaf. Now, from there, we're going to start here at the bottom. And we're going to make just a little circle come around like so on both sides. And then we're going to come right here. And we're going to make another little circle. Kind of make it have a lip. Okay. So that it looks like it's kind of doubled there. We're going to make it in a pot or a vase. And then you come down on both sides. Kind of make it a little curve at the bottom. And then you are ready to color. But... Most important, when you do a drawing, when you get your marker, the first thing you do is autograph it. So go ahead and write your autograph over here. It's my autograph. And so do your autograph, and then uh, you're ready to color. And you can go back and put, you can make it, you can make the rose or the, flower, whatever color you'd like. I'm going to make mine blue, uh, red since today's Valentine's Day. And when you are coloring, you want to use little strokes for little folks. So you don't get out of the line. You stay in the line, go very slow. And mine's kind of bleeding over. I like to use colored pencils or crayons. But since I'm on a dry erase board, I can't do that. And my red, when I get real close, it bleeds in. But yours won't do that if you don't use a marker. If you use uh, colored pencils or crayons, 
Use little strokes so that you stay in the line. And you're, if you use little strokes for little folks, you're coloring every bit of the white. So none of the white will sh leave. And you will take your time and go ahead and color the flower red. And then your stem should be what color? Green is right. So then I'm going to use a little bit of green. And once again, little strokes. For little folks and now I got to do my leaf make sure you do your leaf green and then inside the pot if you want or the vase if you want that to be water you can do it blue if you want it to be dirt you can do it brown I'm gonna do mine brown inside here so I'm gonna put mine in dirt so maybe they can, I can tell them that they can replant it outside and make it grow. And remember, you're not scribbling. You're using little strokes for little folks. You got it. Little strokes for little folks. And color that in brown. And then your pot, you can color whatever color you choose. You can use um, any color pink, um, brown, purple, whatever color you want your pot to be. I hope you enjoyed your story time today and drawing time and make it something special. And go ahead and you can write up here, I love you. And then you can give this to someone special for you. Or you could even write Happy Valentine's Day. You can write either one of those or both. I hope you enjoyed your drawing today. And give somebody special a card. And don't forget, give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed this. And if you'd like more drawings, let me know that so that we can do that. And share me with your friends. Go ahead and hit that subscribe and share button. And we'll have, and comment and let me know if you like the drawing. And we will continue to draw some. Um, most important. Give somebody a hug and, of all days, tell them you love them. Have a great one.